Hi everyone, it's Chris Noel Crawley. I am gonna show you today how I do my very minimal and low key everyday makeup look using all Hourglass products. First product I'm gonna use, number 28 primer. I love this primer, it's very luxurious. It's very moisturizing and it's very effective with keeping my makeup on all day. Smells amazing, feels amazing. Next up is the Vanish Foundation. It's not too heavy. It's not too light. Do you see that? It's like the perfect match. That's crazy. It's really hard for me to get a perfect match with foundation because um, of the undertones in my skin. So I love that I don't have to mix this. Now I'm gonna use my Veil Retouching Fluid. I like the color Sand. Got like all these red bumps. I'm gonna use this brush just to blend. Get all that redness out. And then I usually will go over it with my finger after, just to kinda make it a little more natural looking blended. Next, I'm going to use the Veil Translucent Setting Powder just to make sure everything stays in place. Next, I'm going to use the Ambient Blush. This color is Euphoric Fusion. Um, and then I'm going to go over it with this bronzer just to like add a little more color. To my face. So I'm going to do my brows. This is the Arch Brow Micro Sculpting Pencil in the Warm Brunette. So first I'm just going to brush up just to get the right shape. And I just do small light strokes. And then I'm going to go over it with the Arch Brow Gel. And this is also in the Dark Brunette. And I like to brush my brows up a little bit, so this helps them to stay in place. And we do the other side. And we always have our one side, like our one brow that looks better. This is definitely my better brow. I'm gonna use the Scattered Light Glitter Eyeshadow. I'm not the best with eyeshadow. I'm more of a liner kind of girl. I'm not able to do a smoky eye or anything like that. So I really like this because it's very um, low maintenance and easy. Brush it on just like this. I love a little bit my corner. And then I'll just blend it with my fingertip. And it's so light and buildable that you can kind of, even if you, you know, get it down here, up there, like it's not going to, show so much, so it's pretty forgiving. Next, I'm gonna do my mascara, my lashes. Usually, in my bathroom, I'll have the hot water running for just a minute. I'll run this under the sink, and it heats up the metal, and so it's like a curling iron for your lashes. It's an amazing trick. I read it in a magazine like maybe 10 years ago, and it's my little secret. So next I'm going to use the Caution Extreme Lash Mascara and I'm just gonna go in and whittle the brush a little bit to make sure I get every little hair. Let's do the bottom a little bit. So I'm going to finish off this eye with one of my favorite things to do which is water lining. Um, it's basically taking a pencil and filling in this little line that's underneath your lashes. Um, this is the 1.5 pencil, which is ophthalmologist tested, so it never irritates my eyes. Gently lift up and fill in. Look at this difference. Isn't that not crazy? You can see the difference is just like night and day. Next, I'm going to do a little bit of highlight. This is the Champagne Flash Vanish Highlighter. I like to do my highlighter on my top of my cheekbone. A little bit, what is this area called? The T-zone. <laughs> a little bit on 
the end of my nose right here. And then I'll do a little bit on my brow bone too. And I just blend this with my finger. Look how much cuter my nose looks with the, <laughs> the highlighter, it's crazy. Like more, more highlighter. Okay, so we're almost done. I'm gonna do my lips. Um, this is the Panoramic Lip Liner Pencil in Eden, which is my favorite color. I use really short strokes just in case I mess up. It's very easy to fix. And I kind of contour my lip a little bit, so I make a little, I go out here. I make a little X right here. I'm not sure exactly what it does. I, I saw like a video of a girl like contouring her lips once and it looked really good. I'm gonna make my line a little bit thicker. And I'm gonna do the bottom lip. And I don't do the middle of my bottom lip. There's really no rhyme or reason <laughs> to my lip technique. I just, you, you'll see it looks good when it's done. So I bring in the corner. And then I'm gonna use the end of the brush to smudge. I just don't want it to look lined, if that makes sense. I want it to look like my natural lip. So I just smudge it. I'm gonna press my lips together. Like this is just my glorious natural lip color, which I love. I'm just gonna do the liner and a gloss. Uh, this is the Unreal Gloss in Ignite. Ugh, this is like my favorite lip gloss ever. It smells so good. And the last thing I'm gonna do is go over my face with the Ambient Lighting Palette. It has three different shades, but I like to just mix it together. This gives me an extra little glow. And then, just have to change. And I'm ready to go.